shalom to everyone who's watching me and listening to me right about now i have a very powerful and amazing word for you my brothers and sisters the word is be very careful because there are people that are waiting for an opportune time to strike you there are people that have been watching you for a long time that have been monitoring you that know your way about they know you're going in and going out they know what you eat they know the places you visit they know your work so my brothers and sisters i want to encourage you not to trust everyone you simply meet people have diabolic motives just because they smile with you just because they seem to be good to you it does not mean they are really good good for you not everything that is good for other people is good for you there are some things that are good for other people but they are dangerous for you they are poisonous against you be very careful the times we are living in are very dangerous times where brother is going to betray brother sister will betray sister someone whom you never thought to betray you would be your betrayer remember that your betrayer is around your betrayer is not someone that is far off you it could be your relative it could be that best friend that has always been planning for your destruction i encourage people to always pray jesus said it so when he found his disciples sleeping he woke them up and told them couldn't you watch with me couldn't you pray with me for at least an hour he requested them to pray with him for at least an hour brothers and sisters what are you doing when you're not praying what are you doing in the middle of the night because your enemies are also busy doing something witches are busy doing witchcraft at night they are busy doing enchantments they are busy casting spells they don't want you to leave they are waiting for an opportune time to attack you i want you to be vigilant I want you to be like a watchman. As you are listening to this message, get time to pray. Get time to repent. Get time to seek the face of God. Because if you ask, he will answer. If you knock, the door shall be opened. If you seek, you shall find everyone that has sought him, has found him. He's not too far. He resides in you. He lives in you. Jesus lives in you. My brothers and sisters, I have come to the end of this word. I hope this word has blessed you. I hope it has encouraged you. I come here on a daily basis to release these words to help you, to let you know that you can make it, that you can rise up again. The Bible says in the book of Job that a tree that is cut down as a paraphrase it has hope that it will sprout out again it will grow if a tree that has been cut down has hope that it can grow what about you i'm here to encourage you that you are going to rise up again you are going to rise up above your enemies you are going to rise up above the storm i hope this word has blessed you i hope it has encouraged you until next time Shalom.